my number one tips would be, I mean, if you can work retail, that is probably one of the best places to start because, you know, you're seeing all of these trends firsthand. Um, I mean, from like a clothing perspective, I feel like seeing the trends, um, seeing what trends are out is really great. And I feel like you also get to work with customers, which is great. And you kind of get to get a feel for what people like, what people don't like. And it just kind of like learning how to like adapt to like different aesthetics. You know, which I mean ties into just staying up to date with trends. I think if you're a stylist, you always want to have the best of the best. Um, you know, and I feel like trends are always changing in fashion, like all the time. Like one thing's in and then another thing's out. It's always good to learn about different body types too. I feel like when I got into the industry, I mean, I've always styled women. Um, all of the brands that I've worked for were women apparel brands. And I mean, I'm a guy, so it's hard for me to know, you know, just the woman's figure. It's like, I could visually see it, but um, when you're working with clothes, um, you just go to find out that there are so many different body types. I think it's really important to develop your own aesthetic um, when you're trying to break into the fashion styling career because I think that just sets you apart. When you're working with different brands, obviously they have their own aesthetic, but I think it's cool when you can kind of put your own twist on things. Um, and I feel like it just makes you a little bit more well-rounded when it comes to styling. I think it's really important to connect and network with anybody and everybody in the industry. I think working in fashion, you always, I don't know, you're always wearing multiple hats. Like I think as a stylist, like I've never really just focused on styling. Like I always do, I've always done content creation. I've learned a little bit of merchandising. I've learned about a little bit about, um, I don't know, like writing copy and just like random things like that. I think the more you know, that just helps you become a little bit more of a well-rounded stylist and obviously just makes you a better team player when it comes to working for a company. Um, and then of course, it's always good to just have fun with it. It's always, I mean, it's fashion. It's not rocket science. It's not open heart surgery. You know, like you should be able to try new things and have fun with it, you know, mix up trends, play with different styles and, you know, just have fun with it. <laughs>